In this video, we'll see the steps to file a GST outward supply return through GST Zen. The main steps are to prepare your data, upload invoices to the government, verify your return summary, and finally submit and file the return. The tax returns page shows the return period, due date, and the steps for filing the return. Let us go through these steps, one by one. For the outward supply return, we need information about sales invoices, credit, and debit notes, and advances received from customers. You can upload them easily using XLS files. GST Zen Importer is flexible and can work with data from any accounting software. Only for the first return for the month of July 2017, the return needs turnover details for the previous financial year and quarter. Next, we provide the serial numbers of invoices, delivery challenge, and other documents issued during the tax period. Now we are ready to log in into the government portal and submit our returns data through GST Zen software. We log in using the portal username and OTP received on the phone. The next step is to upload our invoices to the government portal. After waiting for about a minute, we get a confirmation that the invoices are uploaded successfully. We can then download and verify the return summary. The summary shows details of various sections of the return. We are now ready to submit our return. Once submitted, the return cannot be modified. So, confirm the summary before submitting. After clicking the submit button, we get a confirmation in a minute. The final step is to apply our digital signature and file the return. Sign up and use for free at www.gstzen.in.